So guys, this is breaking news. It's like 11 o'clock at night. It's way past my bedtime. But on Twitter, Twitter's the place to be if you're in the Tesla community. That's where all the breaking news is at. But if you're not on Twitter, I got the scoop for you. Two people have publicly announced that they have the full self-driving beta. So like this is legit full self-driving, not like navigate on autopilot. This is like full, full self-driving. So I'm gonna go over everything with you guys. I have some tweets, some images. There might be some more stuff coming out as I make this video. I have no clue, it's literally breaking right now. Um, but before we get started guys, be sure to like this video and subscribe, definitely subscribe because as more information comes out, I'm definitely gonna make another video on the topic. But as of right now, I just wanna share with you like the absolute most breaking information on this. So the first tweet I saw, tweet I saw was from Tesla owner Silicon Valley. I'll put links to their Twitter profile below. Make sure you follow them. But they said, hey Tesla family, myself and flawed, flawed, fraud, <laughs> I don't even know how to say that properly. Um, we're selected to be part of the full self-driving early access program. This is a special full self-driving early access where Tesla has invited me to share my experiences. Let's go. And it, you can see where it says they are installing version 2020.40.8.10. And a lot of people didn't believe them. They thought they were just joking, which it, it seems too good to be true. And they said, this isn't a joke. Tesla has invited me to be a special part of full self-driving beta program where I can share my experiences on social media. So that's honestly pretty crazy because we all just kind of anticipated that this super early access full self-driving beta would be super under NDA. Like any leaks we saw probably would be bad quality. The leaks would be from like someone that anonymously gives their information to a source and with this full self-driving beta being so limited, who would share if they were under NDA because they could probably easily be found out. So this is so crazy that Tesla is actually encouraging people to share their experiences. That's great. Um, and then their last tweet, they just said almost done, super stoked. And then after the update installed, they actually posted the release notes and you can kind of see a little screenshot. That's like, what the new visualization will look like. It's all just super beta, so I'm sure it will change, but that's pretty interesting. It really shows a lot more than it typically does right now. But it says, full self-driving is in, is in early limited access beta. It must be used with additional caution. It may do the wrong thing at the wrong time, so you must always keep your hands on the wheel and pay extra attention to the road. Do not become complacent. When full self-driving is enabled, your vehicle will make lane changes off highway, select forks to follow your navigation route, navigate around other vehicles and objects, and make left and right turns. Use full self-driving in limited beta only if you pay constant attention to the road and be prepared to act immediately, especially around blind corners, cross intersections, and narrow driving situations. Full self-driving, like legit full self-driving, we don't really know when it was, was coming and like we're actually getting a glimpse into it like it's actually a real possibility right now so that's amazing um that's not the only person that posted full self-driving stuff so this other person which i'll put his twitter um information down below as well um he said this is absolutely incredible what is coming with the full self-driving beta tesla gave me the okay to post this on social media one day soon we will be having self-driving cars still excited to be part of this movement this love this is part of the development UI and not final release sneak peek. So on this part, like you can literally see, I mean, this isn't, this doesn't really give us much additional information than what we know right now, other than all the dots, like it's doing way more computations. What I am really curious about and what I wanna see is I wanna see this thing make a turn at a red light. I just want to I want to see an experience that's so bad. I cannot wait for videos on it. Oh my god, so I'm editing this video right now and we have more information like literally just came out as I'm about to publish this video um, from the same guy, Brandon EE916. Again, his information is down below. Big thanks to him cuz it's his video. But when we watch it, you can see in the autopilot options, there's actually a full self-driving beta option. So if you wanna test out the beta, you just tap that. If you're getting tired and like stressed from testing the beta, I guess, if it's like 
where you have to pay that much attention. You can always disable it. But yeah, there you go, on and off. But in the video, he goes over to like a real video of the full self-driving beta. You can see all the detail of what the car sees. So you know it can it can take that right turn right there. Ugh, I want to see this in action. I want to see the Tesla turning because we all know what Teslas look like with Smart Summon. I just hope it's not that chaotically bad. I'm so excited. No joke, guys. I was like seven minutes away from my video being uploaded. I, I already published it and everything, but I found more information. So <laughs> the Brandon EE916 guy, he's he's the real deal. He's posting more, and I it's just such a good vid video. I need to share it because it's just way better. It just makes my video better by, by posting this. So he says, very difficult to get video shot. I'll get a better video soon. It turned on the signal, waited for the car and pedestrians at night. Incredible work, Tesla. So it's just a 31 second video. It's really unfortunate because it's only the shot of the screen. We can't see the Tesla actually driving, but you can kind of get an idea of what it's seeing and what it's doing. You can see a car going through the intersection and it's trying to turn. And then it turns. And from the visualization, like it looks like it turned pretty well. I've literally tried to upload this video so many times, but more information is, is coming out. Um, so Brandon says, the future is coming. Full self-driving beta is here. I hope Tesla makes progress to get this out to more people soon. Full in intersection rendering on the dev UI is incredible. I don't have any interaction other than modifying my following distance. So I'm gonna play you the 45 second clip of their tweet and leave you. I have nothing else to say. The only problem with me uploading this video, I feel like if I upload this video, more stuff is going to come out. So definitely make sure you're subscribed because I have a feeling tomorrow morning when I wake up, I'm going to make another video that's going to have way more information. Um, if you made it this far, thanks for watching. Be sure to like the video if you forgot to and subscribe. Um, stay tuned for more videos when we get more information. Bye.